When you hear the word cheesecake, what do you think of? For most people, it's this. Thick cream cheese with a buttery biscuit base. But here in Japan, it's completely different to what you know. Today, Food Tribe's in the heart of Osaka trying out Japanese cheesecake. This is Uncle Rikuro's Cheesecake Cafe, where locals and tourists alike from all around the world flock to come get a taste of what everyone's been talking about. Established in 1989, Rikuro Nishimura opened up his first store in Namba. Today, his brand has made a mark on Japanese desserts ever since, quite literally, on the cheesecakes. But what's so different about this particular cheesecake? Firstly, its appearance. The cake is renowned for its incredible fluffiness, as well as its famous jiggly movement. The jiggle itself is one of the main aesthetic features that led it to become a viral phenomenon, with everyone fascinated by its unique movement. I mean, just look at it, it's mesmerizing. As for the ingredients, it's not too dissimilar from Western cheesecake. It includes egg, milk, cream cheese, butter, sugar, and flour. However, one key ingredient that's different are the sweetened raisins, which are sprinkled around the base of the cake. According to Uncle Rikolo, the raisins are packed with what he describes as feelings or accents to add extra sweetness to the cheesecake. Now, the baking process is what's most fascinating about this cake. It's baked on top of a hot water base, which allows the cakes to fluff up as much as it does. This is what gives it that lovely texture, and of course, the jiggle. After they're taken out of the oven, they're branded with their signature logo, which is done in front of the customers. They give the option to dine in their quick seating area or upstairs in their relaxing tea room. Unfortunately, this time round, the tea room was closed, so I had to sit downstairs. Either way, the cheesecake will most likely be demolished within a matter of minutes. So here we are, Japan's fluffiest, jiggliest cheesecake. I haven't eaten all day, so this is going to be a treat. As you can see, inside it's so fluffy. Anyway, bottoms up. It's so good. Now the cheese flavor isn't that overpowering, but it's mainly the texture and the sweetness and the fluffiness that you enjoy. Now a lot of people, they look at the cake and they think it's so big and they can't have it all by themselves, but you can easily hoover this whole thing down. I know I said I was gonna be able to finish this whole thing, but I'm starting to get a bit defeated already. I mean, I've only got scraps left, but that is one filling cake. These cakes are baked all day and all year round. They bake them by the dozen and only close for one day of the year, New Year's Day. Now that's dedication. So next time you're in Japan, be sure to make a quick stop at Uncle Rikuro's Cheesecake Cafe. You won't regret it. If you like this video, tell me what other foods you'd like me to try in Japan. Let me know in the comments below.